OnePlan Solutions is pleased to introduce the OnePlan for JIRA app. This is an app for JIRA that adds Strategic Portfolio Management or SPM capabilities to your use of JIRA. If you go to the apps menu within JIRA when it's installed, you can actually go and select one plan and activate it. Now, within that, we can then add all the portfolio management capabilities from one plan into your JIRA environment. For example, here, we're looking at a portfolio structure that can be created of your own choosing. In this case, we have portfolios with programs within them, and then the epics are coming from JIRA itself and are the portfolio items that we're managing from a portfolio management perspective. Now, if we drill into a specific epic, we can add additional portfolio level capabilities or data that help us slice and analyze our portfolio and provide uh, important information to leadership, whether it be the metadata that you capture to categorize and classify your projects, whether it be business, inform business case information, whether it be different prioritization methods that you use, whether it's business case driver or WSJF or weighted shortest job first, as well as aligning it with any particular enterprise architecture elements and strategies like the objectives and key results that they may be aligned with, the applications in your application portfolio that they may be dependent on, as well as associated products that may have to be factored in or dependent on uh, this particular epic. On top of that, we also have a work planning capability that allows us to bring in the backlog items from JIRA as well and use that to roll up to the portfolio. In this particular case, I'm showing a backlog of features and user stories, even down to the task level, to bring in from JIRA into this backlog work plan type. It can bring in whatever data you like, your story points, your resources, and other elements, what teams are involved, etc. Even sprint planning can be done within here and reflect the sprint planning that's been done within JIRA itself. We can even have a schedule work log type that allows us to uh, put in the schedule of when release schedules are due or other elements that senior leadership or your internal or external customers may be interested in. We can even do resource planning. It allows us to do resource planning in a flexible set of ways. You can plan in terms of, say, you know, hours, or you can plan in full-time equivalents or percentages of allocation. You can plan in terms of named individuals, or you can plan in terms of roles, for example, or maybe even just at a team level, what teams you'd like to have associated with these, so you can do overall capacity planning within this. Now, from that perspective, you can then roll all this up to a portfolio, and in that portfolio, you could look at things like an overall financial summary, for example, and allow you to have different list views with different data elements that allow you to take different uh, analysis and decision support information from the combination of JIRA and OnePlan to get full portfolio management capabilities. So, for example, here I'm looking at financial information. I might look at more of an alignment view and see, for example, with the associations I showed earlier on, uh, what things are associated here. For example, the key results, which are the strategies that are related to these particular epics, or potentially the, the associated products that are associated with these as well, and be able to understand fully the dependencies that I have across all of these. We can even have board views in here. If I go and look at, at a portfolio board and look at the board by state, uh, I can have flexible views in here where I have the different states of particular portfolio items and even backlog items that I can determine whether or not to drag them in. I can even have different limits like budgets or story points or even work and process or WIP limits up here to understand when I've exceeded those at the top level here when I'm actually doing my planning and determining what things I can work on next. I can even... Uh, you know, have variations of this board, let's say, for example, state by points. And if I have a limit on story points that I would like to have in any one active state, more of a kind of a work in process limit, I can have that in here as well. I also have roadmap views for the product oriented folks. If I look at, say, for example, a roadmap by business unit, I can look at the different business unit, the different epics that are being worked on in here, and even the key elements or releases or key uh, events that have to happen along those, as well as indicators of progress within those roadmaps. Now, the uh, new capability of the modeler in here allows us to do what-if scenario modeling and allows us to go in and evaluate alternatives uh, by selecting groups of epics or projects and being able to uh, evaluate which ones are included in the mix and then allow us to uh, analyze different models. So, for example, if I came in and looked at um, um, a scenario of a $4 million budget, uh, and if I have a look at all these potential projects and active projects and say, within that $4 million budget, what can I do? 
and then look at the current targets and what that $4 million bid budget would let me do. It would allow me to do 12 of these epics, right? It would allow me to get uh, $11 million worth of benefit. Uh, but if I also wanted to look at, say, a $5 million budget, it might say if I can get that extra million dollars, could I get another $2.3 million worth of benefit in order to do that? So the idea is I can compare alternatives and look at the details around those, whether it be uh, um, budgets, whether it be story points or epics, whether it be benefits or other data elements, I can look and see that I can now do 16 epics for that $5 million and get a view up above that will show me what's in and what's out and what's made it into the mix and what we can't do based upon that scenario. From an execution perspective, we have the ability to have a my work area. So if you have a combination of work being done in JIRA as well as other places alone, all that project work, whether it be tasks or backlog items, can all be uh, updated right here from within one plan, whether in a list view where you actually update the work items or from a board perspective as well where you drag things through their different statuses. There's also a timesheet in here. So if you want to work and recapture time for capitalization, chargebacks, or billing to customers, we have a native timesheet in here that will actually grab your uh, JIRA work items and allow you to report time on those in a seamless fashion. So that's it for now. Uh, please check us out and see how this can be used to enhance your use of JIRA and provide portfolio management capabilities.